one butterfly kick, one breaststroke pull, one breaststroke kick. That is what the FINA rules approve in the breaststroke pull up up until the recording of this video. So far, the two most common ways of doing this to do the pull and the butterfly kick at the same time or to do the butterfly kick first and the pull and the kick after. The most important thing is to keep your body tight and in a horizontal position. Your streamline should be extremely compact. You only have one butterfly kick so make it count by doing a strong one. Your arms will pull as much water as possible and will come down to the side of your body. From there you must shrug your shoulders and pause a little bit. Now you will recover your arms the closest way to your body as possible, which many swimmers found is like this. The kick goes at the same time as the recovery of the arms. What the kick does is to give you that final push forward and up to break the surface of the water. The breaststroke pullout is all about actions and pauses. You push off the wall or off the blocks, get in a streamlined position and pause. Do a butterfly kick and pause. Do a stroke and pause. Shock your shoulders and pause. Arms recovery and kick and now the action of the stroke begins. Some breaststrokers swim more than 15 meters with a dive and one pull up. They are able to do this because of the incredibly horizontal position of their body during the pauses and the strength of their movements. If you practice consistently and receive feedback from others, you will be able to do this as well. This video is sponsored by Great Towel Company. They sent us two of their towels and I can honestly tell you that this is the best towel I have used. The fabric is soft, absorbs all the water and dries so quickly it doesn't even look like you used it. Best of all, it fits in this small mesh bag. Perfect for traveling. Check out the link in the description to buy one. Thanks for watching. Swim fast.